minutes ago, and here is how it got underway. Three wide going down towards the first corner. This on board with Stefan Ortelli as he tried to make his way through. Uh, Enrique Chavez starting at the front there. We had the Bentley run over the curb. Likewise, Christian Klein with nowhere to go, but everyone just about made it through safely otherwise. Battling for the lead, the RS Racing Cars was one of the stars of the show at the start. The number 25 with Daniele Diamato fighting his way through from the back end of the top 10 to get up the field. Uh, Alexei Nezov was another there with the green and white Mercedes, the AM driver fighting with Christian Klein. Halfway through, then we had the pit stops as ever there was our race leaders going in. When they come in, the number 16 took over the race lead. Out of Estante was leading in GT Cup Open Europe when he came in. When we resumed, it was Miguel Ramos leading the way as our Pro-Am leaders came in. This was the moment that Charlie Eastwood would hand over to Sally Ulick. Fighting continued, though, in the second half of the race, eventful as it always is. Unfortunately, Sally Ulick, though, very short into his stint, would be tagged round by Bart Barrage. And then we had the barriers exploded, and that would bring out the safety car. When we got going, the number 59 versus the 17 was the story of the race. Yannick Mettler was trying his best to hold off the rest of the field. Angelo Negro there locking up the tyres. But this was the move that won the race. Vincent Abreu diving down the inside, just about getting the car stopped and on the exit, asserting his place in the lead. And he'd go on to take the win for AF Corsa on home soil.